This is a seated bimanual grasp, distal forearm hand for a medial to lateral and lateral to medial glide restriction or a medial to lateral and lateral to medial tilt restriction of the intercarpal joints. In this adjustment here, we're going to use the fact that uh, these two rows of carpals here provide a tilt and then also a glide. And we're going to use those two motions uh, when we have a restriction with this patient. So if my patient is, is palm up here, I'm going to grasp at the distal radius and ulna, grasp at uh, the distal uh, intercarpal joints, and then provide, in this instance, a lateral to medial uh, force. So my uh, right hand here is going to provide a force lateral to medial, like this. The next adjustment then is a, a tilt. So if we feel a restriction in the tilt that we have in this patient, we'll provide a, a little bit of overpressure. We have to be very careful with this style of an adjustment. It's more of a mobilization where we will gently add in tilt. We don't ever want to bring a whole lot of force. This way we can injure the ligaments as they lay on the lateral aspect of the hand there. So this was a seated bimanual grasp, distal forearm hand for medial to lateral and lateral to medial glide and tilt restrictions of the intercarpal joint.